Hello there and welcome to the new Google Data Studio tutorial where I will show you how you can show the top n values for the table. So many times we have the requirement in almost every dashboard that you will going to create that what are your top 10 categories let's say by sales, by profit, by discount and all that. And the reason why this is so important because uh, it has a keen interest because they make a very big tent either on the positive side or on the negative side so because of the influential nature of these rows they are always of a greater interest of the uh, anyone similar uh, for example the end user who is who needs to make a decision or who needs to figure out what is influencing their business so how we can do that is let's see this so here we are in the edit mode and let's select this product subcategory which is showing the profit and sales and down there we have the option where we can show the row per page so for now let's see the top five values so top five categories by or top five product subcategories by the sales along with the sales so this this information is then available you can customize like i'm customizing the report but the only thing is this this shows this additional information one to five oblique 17 because what it does if i go into the front end using view mode i can then click over here and this will be this is nothing but the pagination then i can see the next top five the next top five and so on and so forth based on the various values which you have but if your need is that you don't want end user to have this option then what you need to do is uh, basically go into the style option over here and down there you will have the option within the table footer that you want to show the pagination or not so you click over here and the pag pagination is removed now if you go into the front end you know the person can only see this information but nothing can be done because we have just removed the pagination so this way based on whatever filters that is present here the value that you will be entering your value or your table will always show the relevant top five values for your uh, report so that's about how you can customize i've shown you both the option if you want to have the multiple top fives or multiple top tens you can have the pagination enabled also you can just remove the pagination option completely and that way you will always have the top five values which is impacted by the various filters which you had at the report level so that's about it and i'll meet you in the next video with a new topic